Hello, everybody. Yo. <laughs> Welcome back to the vlog. <sighs> Liv and I are on the way, as you can tell from the title of this video, to Jacksonville. We met up in Columbia because she was coming from Myrtle and I was coming from Greenville. So we met in the middle and now we are headed there. Had to stop for Starbucks first, of course. So we're going there, obviously, to see Trevor and Marissa, but it's like an excuse to celebrate my birthday with them. Sorry about my chomping. Olivia will be chomping to my left, so <laughs> ignore her. But it's an excuse to celebrate my birthday with them because Monica and Marissa were on their honeymoons while it was my birthday. So didn't get to see them. Olivia, I did get to see and hang out with. It's just her and I going today. Monica and Dalton are coming tomorrow. And then Andrew, Trevor, and Darian are coming on Friday. LOL, Trevor coming to his own his house. Own Trevor's training in Clemson, I think. And him and Darian are going to ride up together. And then Andrew has to work, so he can't come till Friday night. So we're just all kind of like Sorry. going at random times. Yeah, I'm very ready to celebrate. It's like four hours from here. So it'll be a good little road trip. What should we talk about? Deep stuff. Of course, of course that's our answer. Let's get deep. I had a lot of people DM me about my last vlog whenever I was talking about how mean that girl was to me and sent me that evil message. <laughs> and everyone was being so nice. They're like, you don't deserve any hate. You are real on social media. Like they were like sticking out for me. It was very nice. Let's see, have I received any other hate comments this week? I wouldn't know because I delete them and genuinely forget about them. <laughs> Maybe I should stop deleting them. Um, I just don't want to give any anyone else any ideas from seeing that comment, you know? No, just delete them because we don't need any negativity hanging around. True. You know what we can talk about is the fact that Olivia oh, blocks sorry. approximately 400 people a day. <laughs> no, the other day. She has an obsession with blocking people. I was laying in bed and it's because I get... Okay. If you really start to think about like who follows you... First of all, I don't like being private. I mean, just... Because then people can't really like share your stories and stuff and that's just It no makes fun. it not fun. Yeah. But then I'm like, I don't want this fifty year old following fifty year old man following me. I don't or know. a woman, like just random people. Yeah, just super random people that I don't really know. So I sat in bed the other day and I blocked two hundred and seventy people. I usually block people if they like say hi to me. <laughs> well not like that, but like if they just look like they're like trying to be creepy. It's a, it's a must block. It's just a feeling that I get. I I don't ever look at who follows me. If I've blocked you and you didn't deserve it, I am sorry. Yeah. I just get scared. I just do it if people are being creepy towards me. I don't know, commenting on my stuff creepy or whatever, but if I really went through my followers, I'm sure I could probably block 6,000 people. Anyway, all right, well, we will continue this conversation Whoa. off camera. Hi, vloggy. Bye, vlog. See you in Jacksonville. We have arrived, but this music is playing in the background, so I cannot record. So, hold on. Okay, of course, we've been here for one hour and she already has the marks out. Cheers. Thank you. Cheers. Nice. Let the birthday weekend begin. We're ordering pizza tonight because we got here way later than we thought we would. I'm not really sure why it took us so long to get here. So that's all we're doing tonight. Um, Darian and Trevor are actually getting here tomorrow now, so that's convenient. So the whole crew besides Andrew will be here. Awesome. <laughs> Very sad for Olivia. So we will see you tomorrow. As you can see, just took a shower. All we did today was have a little pool day. We did get some coffee and then some breakfast before, had some lunch at the house. Have you noticed that I'm not showing a lot of the house? Trevor and Marissa just decided that they want to keep it private for now. And so we'll not be doing a tour or anything like that. I definitely want to respect that that's what they want to do. So I'll only be showing like little parts of the house. Right now I am about to edit my Princess Polly haul that will be coming out last week now so if you have not watched it go watch it after this video is finished a lot of you guys ask me where i get my clothes and that is the answer so y'all go watch it also my skin is literally freaking out i don't really know what is going on i don't know if it's a hormonal thing or what but 
I kind of talked to you guys about back to 30 a few weeks ago and so next week I'm going there to get my skin analysis and they're gonna help get my skin right and smooth and glowy I'll take you guys along with me to do that next week so just look out for that in the next vlog so I think that'll be exciting to see and kind of see what they say about my skin and like what it needs but right now I'm gonna finish editing my vlog and then once Monica and Dalton get here at like 7 30 we're gonna go get some dinner a quick little pause in this Jacksonville vlog because we need to talk about my new dossier perfume. I have talked about them a lot on my channel because I'm obsessed with them. If you do not know anything about dossier, they recreate high-end luxury perfumes for an affordable price. So if you love a high-end expensive perfume and you are just not willing to pay the $50 to $280 that it costs. They make perfumes that are inspired by those perfumes and smell virtually the same. I have used their Floriental Vanilla scent for probably like six months now, a long time, and I'm obsessed with it. And ever since then, they have sent me some new perfumes to try, and I haven't disliked one yet. And something that I love about them is it is a risk-free system. They send you a little sample size in every single bottle that you purchase so that you can try it. And if you do not like it, you can send it back within 30 days and get a full refund, no questions asked. Also, all of their perfumes are $29. And again, it smells almost the exact same as these high-end luxury perfumes. So I've loved using them for as long as I have. And today we are trying a new scent that I have never smelled before. I always try it on camera so I can give you guys my honest review of it. But today we are trying the Florental Brown Sugar. And this is inspired by YSL Mon Paris. Here we go, let's try away. Also their bottles and their packaging is just so cute. I don't know if you can really tell because it also tells you all of the, the top notes on there as well. So let's try this. Oh, this is very like um, warm, but also sweet. It's so hard to describe these perfumes. Like I don't, I've learned how bad I am at it over the times that I've worked with them, but this smells really, really good. I think this might go into my number two spot after Florental Vanilla. Florental Brown Sugar is really good. I could almost see like Darian wearing this. It could definitely be like a boy or girl scent just because it's like a really warm smell. I don't know if that makes sense, but it smells really, really good. This is definitely my second favorite now. So lucky for y'all, um, Dossier gave me a 10% off code for all of my subscribers. So if you are wanting to try one of their perfumes, you guys can go on their website. They have a ton of different options. Go see if the perfume that you spend too much money on is on there so you can save some coin. And use my code Mackenzie10 for 10% off of your order. They ship really quickly and they're a great company and they're super helpful. So go get your perfume. Okay, back to Jacksonville. Three hours later and I finally finished my video. Monica and Dalton are actually running a little late and dinner is at eight o'clock. So we are gonna go without them. But I am starving and we're about to leave. So I need to get dressed. Dinner was great. As you can see, Dalton and Monica did make it. I was mistaken. Remember, I told you I was so confused. Marissa and I had an, uh, had an ongoing text conversation about whether we were going with him or not, and I got confused and mistook something that she said. But now we are walking to ice cream. What's it called? Whoa, Wits, I think. It's like a frozen custard place. Yeah. What's on your mind? Excuse me, lovebirds, can you show me your rings? Excuse me, lovebirds, can you show me your rings? Gorgeous. Gorgeous. Delicious. 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 Good morning, everybody. It is Friday. Darian and Trevor got home yesterday night at like midnight. So they are finally here. We are about to grab coffee again because we were going to make lattes here and there's no almond milk or oat milk left. So we decided to just go get lattes and get the oat milk later. And then we're going to go to breakfast and have a little beach day. So bring you guys along. I don't need to think about it. 
There's nothing in this world that we can't do Flowers even mad about it Cause they can't blow like you don't I don't see a way around it Cause everything has led me straight to you It's nothing new Baby, I'm outside But think Duval! Okay, what are we doing today? Um, you're gonna get your nails done and your toes done. Pedicure! Pedicure! Go to the beach! Come up! Sunrise, no destination, no lie. I've been so patient, like winter, waiting for June. I'm done and waiting for you, waiting for you, baby. I'm we are walking to dinner right now. Even though the ballet was open, we didn't know. The boys are already inside. I don't even know what it's called, but yeah, we had a fun day doing random stuff. Going to the beach and all of that, and then we're going to dinner, and that's really it for today. Oh, I somehow got dessert with only the boys. That's what you just saw. I went with them to a different ice cream shop while the other girls went to a different ice cream shop that they wanted. But I'm about to get my PJs on. I'm extremely exhausted. I think we're going to go play games or like something random. So I'm not going to film the rest of the night. But tomorrow is going to be my, my fake birthday redemption thing since they couldn't be with me on my birthday. I don't really know exactly everything that we're doing, but yeah. <laughs> Honey from the cone. Got a little toasty yesterday. We have to leave today, so I just don't want to shower before we have to go because I don't know. I just have taken so many showers. I'm just over it. We're leaving at four o'clock. It's like two thirty now, so everyone's in the pool just hanging out. Yesterday, they surprised me with like a cake on this rooftop, and we went to dinner and came home and played games. It was a lot of fun. They're watching me talk right now. Stop guys, y'all talk to your camera too. Anyway, this trip has just been a lot of fun. And I just always love all the time that we get to spend together. And I'm sad to leave. I'm sad that there's no more lattes. I'm sad that I can't eat a bagel every day. I'm sad that I won't see Indy anymore. Still have like another hour here and then we'll hit the road. 
better. Bye bye. Bye everybody. Bye. Bye. See you. We will leave in each other again. Doesn't feel right. <laughs> bye bye. So sad. Bye bye. <laughs> sad. And you're not riding with me this time. No, it's very sad. Bye bye. Bye. Uh, eating food. <laughs> Aren't you sad? So sad. Bye. Huh. Andy, you pay attention she right now. Come here! Bye, Andy! Thank you! Alright, guys, we are on the road. We left about an hour ago. We kind of have a long road ahead of us. We left way too late because we couldn't stop talking to everyone. But this was definitely the best birthday after birthday party and weekend. I just love everybody and it was just a very special weekend. What was your favorite part? Uh, cool volleyball and then just hanging with everybody. My what about anything with me? <laughs> oh, I was just celebrating with Anthony for the second time. She deserves all the, the praise, honor, and good things. We had a good time. Well, guys, we're so close to 15,000. If you have not yet, subscribe. Let me know what your favorite part of this vlog was. Let me know what you guys want to see. And I will see y'all very soon with another vlog. Bye!